Hi, I'm Lisa Challenger, Worcester County Tourism Director, and welcome to another edition of Beach and Beyond. Today we're going to be here at the Chesapeake Bay Farms, sampling some of their fabulous ice cream and checking out the whole operation to see how this great stuff is made. And then we'll also be heading over to visit with Sean at Fishtails and out to the Ocean City Golf Club to talk to Buddy Sass to give us some great golfing tips and heading over to Ocean City to see some of my good friends in the tourism business to tell us all of the fun and exciting things going on in Ocean City this summer. So stick around and we hope you enjoy the show. Hello, I'm Eileen Bennett. I'm the Executive Director here at Brandywine Senior Living at Fenwick Island. At Brandywine, we offer assistance to our residents in the most elegant surroundings. From our captain's table dining room to our serenade services, you'll find an enthusiastic team of professionals here to help you in any way you may need. Brandywine does things different. Life is beautiful at Brandywine. Let me show you why. Welcome to Brandywine. But the people that I met here are fantastic. Uh, we personally knew the chef here because she cooked for us before, so we knew the food was going to be good. And um, it was just a very comfortable place. To be able to do a dish and go out to the dining room and have my residents smile at me and tell me how wonderful it is, just is awesome as far as I'm concerned. It just makes my heart happy. We have found a multitude of friends here. Uh, we have a lot of activities. We sing, we dance. Believe it or not, we even sing karaoke. Our residents have such a varied listing of events that they can do every day. We offer several things that they can choose to take part in so they can pick and choose the things that they're interested in. Everything from lifelong learning where they have the opportunity to learn something new or even just more about something that they aren't already familiar with, um, whether it's stamp collecting, any type of antiquing, uh, cupcake decorating, all sorts of things like that. Card sharks, um, do some blackjack, uno, we like to keep things really active, really fun, not just your normal card games. Also cooking with class, they get the chance to do a real life cooking demonstration similar to what you would find on TV nowadays, only they get to participate and then they get to reap the benefits when they're done. Fun, fit and fabulous, we have a very competitive group of residents who love to do exercise every day. We like to get them involved with that, get their get their energy ramped up and kind of get them going. Also Brandy Luck, we do, we have slot machines, pool tables, blackjack, we really turn it into a real casino here at Brandywine, so it's not just sitting around playing blackjack, it's an actual casino experience. My mother has been living here for three years and she's never been a moment with nothing to do. There's more activities and she has to choose what to do. There's so many things on the plate every day. Every single person here treats my dad like a king and he has said that. He said, they treat me like a king here and he's, he's, he just feels very at home and that was a huge, huge step uh, for our father. I would recommend Brandy Wine as far as it being safe. Um, they keep her busy, they keep the family informed, and I think it's just the, the right place and it's the right fit for mom. Being part of the Brandy Wine team means that I am part of a caring group that while they are taking care of the residents that live here, also have a good time and in that respect I feel make the residents have a good time and that's part of being that team. And I just enjoy being around the residents, they're joy to me. They give me joy and I give them joy. So as you can see, Brandywine Senior Living at Fenwick Island is a wonderful place to live. From the elegant surroundings to the secure environment to our Escapades for Life program, you have many options and choices on what you can do to live your life to the fullest. So Kathy, Tell me a little bit about how someone can reach out to Brandywine if they'd like to get a little more information or come to see some of our beautiful surroundings. Well, that's a great question. We can be reached 24 hours a day, seven days a week, by calling one 877 brandy or you can go on our website at www.brandycare.com. Excellent. You know what I have to say about that? Let's do a toast, because after all, life is beautiful. Hi, I'm Lisa Challenger, and we are here at Chesapeake Bay Farms today. It's just outside of Pocomoke City, and I'm with co-owner Danny Holland. Danny, thanks for being on the show today. Thanks for having me. Tell us a little bit about Chesapeake Bay Farms, and you're talking about the, we're talking about the dairy operation here, so tell us a little bit about 
All right, it's a third generation dairy. Um, we have about 190 animals. Um, we milk about 70. The rest are younger heifers, or I'd also do some grass-fed beef. Um, and we take the milk uh, that we produce right here and we turn it into um, ice cream, cheese, um, butter, and milk. So you were telling me earlier that's known as a cow to cone operation and you're the only one on Delmarva? Is yes. that correct? Um, on the Eastern Shore. On the Eastern Shore. Yeah. That is really awesome. So we are going to take a look at, I guess, the whole, you're going to let us in and take a look at the processing and, uh, and then the retail operation. Yes. Sound like a plan? Yes. Okay, let's go. <laughs> All right. So now we're in the processing department of the farm and we're with Laura Holland, who is also co-owner of Chesapeake Bay Farms. And Laura, thanks for joining us and Thank thanks you. for showing us a behind the scenes kind of tour here. This is exciting. So tell us what goes on in here. Well, this is our processing facility. It's connected to the room where we actually physically milk the cows. All the milk is pumped over to another room and then over to where we pasteurize it in the room next to us. Um, from there, we either make an ice cream mix for our ice cream, we make mozzarella cheese, we bottle milk. So you've got all 190, I think, heads of cattle, you said, and all of that is processed through this area right here. Yes, a portion of that is processed here for all the products we need to sell to our wholesalers and our retail outlets. And I understand you will be doing some group tours when you're ready for that in the spring yes, and fall? Yes, to tours are by appointment only in the spring and the fall. So we're getting a behind the scenes look today, but not everybody can do that yet. So next, I think we're going to go into the retail yes. operation where everybody can go and yes. buy the ice cream and the cheeses and the milk and, and all the good stuff. Just right across the parking lot. Okay, so we can take our hair nets and we our go. little footies and we let's head over there. Okay, so now we're in the retail store and I love the building coming Thank in. You. And I guess people can't see the ceiling, but I really love the pink and ceiling. So tell us about what you sell in here because it smells so good. Well, we sell all of our fresh local products. We have a bottled milk, um, our own mozzarella cheese, as well as several other varieties of cheese we make, uh, hand dipped ice cream, as well as prepackaged ice cream and pints and quarts. Uh, we have fresh churned butter. And we've also incorporated some other local artisans to make um, homemade bread. Um, you see here, these are local jam and jelly Preserves. Mm -hmm. And what are your hours of operation? When can people come and visit you? Um, we're open Wednesday through Sunday, and uh, after Memorial Day, we'll be open every day. Every day. And what are your hours from when um, to when? 11 to 7, and Sunday is uh, 1 to 7. Okay. And there are some things for kids to do out here. Yes like the milking cow, mm -hmm. and you've got the picnic tables, mm -hmm. and you're working on a little trail here. Exactly, we want this to be a family atmosphere, somewhere you can come and relax and enjoy nature. and A great and just place have for the whole family. Mm -hmm. Thank you, Thank and to you, you and your much. husband both for being on the show today. This is a fabulous place, and I can't wait to try some ice cream. Thank you, help yourself. Thank you. Introducing the Gateway Grand Residences on the oceanfront at 48th Street in Ocean City, Maryland. The Gateway Grand is the newest and most luxurious oceanfront community at the beach. You'll find unparalleled attention to detail, superior construction quality, countless relaxing amenities, and beach services that can't be found at any other beach property. The Gateway Grand is a joint partnership between two of the country's largest and most reputable development companies. Trammell Crow Company and the Carlisle Group. If you're looking to buy the best of the best, look no further. The Gateway Grand's Control Access Lobby means a quiet, relaxing stay at your beach place in a controlled environment. The private outdoor pool is located on a 250-foot long elevated oceanfront sun deck where you and your family and friends can enjoy some time basking in the sun or cooling off in the refreshing waters. Have you had enough sun? Or is the weather not to your liking? Then move inside to the indoor pool, where you can still enjoy full views of the beach and the ocean. With perfectly heated waters and open year-round, you'll be able to enjoy the indoor pool 365 days a year. Like to work out? Look no further than our state-of-the-art fitness center. Open 24-7. Get in your daily calorie burn while keeping a close eye on your kids swimming in the indoor pool. Or simply enjoy the serenity of the ocean views. When the day is over, retreat to your home away from home. Our residences feature everything that you're looking for for the perfect beach getaway. 
designer furnishings, luxurious baths, spacious kitchens and living areas, and soaring nine-foot ceilings. The Gateway Grand is built with a high-impact skin and window structure that meets not just Ocean City construction code, but that of Miami-Dade, one of the highest in the country. The Gateway Grand features sound insulation in all of the walls, both interior and exterior. Enjoy a peaceful, quiet beach getaway year-round. Do you hate fighting the elements just to get from the elevator to your unit? Not at Gateway Grand. We provide our owners with climate-controlled corridors, allowing comfortable year-round use for all of our owners. Imagine leaving your residence in the middle of February, getting on one of our five high-speed elevators, and then walking to the indoor pool all in the comfort of your shorts and sandals. Or maybe you've stayed someplace where there wasn't enough parking. Gateway Grand takes care of our owners here too. We've got a six-story private gated and secure parking facility on site and every one of our owners gets a minimum of two parking passes, meaning you'll never worry about parking at the beach again. So if you're considering buying a new beach retreat, or maybe you're looking to upgrade your current beach home, make sure you stop by the Gateway Grand to see what we have to offer. We promise you'll love what you see. The sales center is open daily from 10 a.m. to 5 p.m. You can visit us online at www.thegatewaygrand.com or call us at 410-723-6290. Welcome to Beach and Beyond. My name is Melanie Purcell, Executive Director with the Greater Ocean City, Maryland Chamber of Commerce. And I have with me today Donna Abbott, Director of Tourism with the Town of Ocean City, and Susan Jones, Executive Director with the Hotel Motel Restaurant Association. We've got an exciting May here in Ocean City, Maryland. The weather is warming up. It's time for summer thoughts. So we're going to talk a little bit about what's going on and how we kick off spring in Ocean City. So Donna, tell us a little bit about what's going on. Well, the best way to kick off spring in Ocean City, of course, is the Ocean City Spring Fest, an annual festival at the Inlet Lot. And that's going to be May 2nd through the 5th. We've got great entertainment lots of free entertainment, some great food, arts, crafts, and uh, you know, just an all-around good time. And that means spring and the coming summer season are definitely upon us when Spring Fest hits the inlet lot. Excellent, excellent. And I know Spring Fest is how many years? That's been about, oh, gosh. Gosh, it's probably been, what, 21, yeah. 22 years, something yeah. like that. And I think know? that the success of Sun Fest really kind of springboarded Spring Fest. So right. it's a great way to kick off the season. And then we've got some other exciting things going on all around town. So Susan, really tell Another good thing to kick off is Restaurant Week. Mm -hmm. Certainly, it's May 5th to the 19th this year. Mm -hmm. And we changed it up a little bit a couple years ago, so we added four price points. It's 10, 20, 30, and $40 to give people a variety of prices and restaurants a variety of menus they can plan. So all those menus are on OceanCityRestaurantWeek.com. And it really gives you a chance to get out and try some different places that you haven't had an opportunity to before. So exactly. I think it's been an excellent, excellent program. Thank it you. has been. I mean, I think it's one of my favorite weeks of the year. I don't know about you all. But an excuse to eat out. Yeah. yeah. Lots have, of fresh seafood. Absolutely. We have some fabulous restaurants in town, too. So the, the Spring Restaurant Week really is a great opportunity for everybody to go out there and sample those mm -hmm. menus. Um, and then there's Cruising Week. I mean, absolutely. what another wonderful May fun. Town is full, for sure. Cars all over the place, all kinds of colors, sizes, shapes. It's not for the, those seeking a quiet weekend. It does get a little <laughs> rambunctious out there, but a lot of activities are happening here at the convention center for that event, as well as down at the inlet lot. So uh, that's a big weekend, and it's right before the Memorial Day weekend, which will mm -hmm. kick off another summer Our in Ocean City. official start to summer Memorial Day weekend, and we, we know it's going to be a beautiful weekend. So for more information about all the things that are going on in May in and around Ocean City, please be sure to visit www.ococean.com. Thank you. Thank you. The Bahia Marina has just what you are looking for this summer. They have boats to rent, so get out on the water. Whether you go exploring on a kayak, cruise the bay on a skiff, or take the whole gang out on a pontoon boat, Bahia Marina rents them all. Climb aboard the Judith M for ocean wreck fishing or stay in the bay with the Tortuga. When you get back, head into Fishtails Bar and Grill. Relax with family, enjoy a great meal, and have a really good time. The Bahia Marina and Fishtails Bar and Grill. Your good time is waiting on 22nd Street in Ocean City. Hi, I'm Michael Day. I'm the Director of Economic Development for the Town of Berlin, Maryland's coolest small town. And right now we are in Tex-Mex and Beyond, one of the newest restaurants to open here in Berlin. Great Mexican and uh, Tex-Mex food. Uh, also down the street is Sekulis, a, a rustic Italian restaurant. Across the street from that is the Maryland Wine Bar. Up the street from that we've got the Main Street Suites, one of the best candy stores you'll ever find. And just a few doors down from that is Cupcakes in Bloom, 
Berlin has really become a food destination, a, a dining restaurant and uh, a specialty foods. A baked dessert cafe over on Bay Street has uh, natural sweets uh, and also sells beer and wine, uh, organic wines and uh, craft beers. We've got uh, the Ber uh, Berlin Coffee House for your coffee of lattes and all the specialty coffees that you can think of. Main Street Deli just opened up a great sandwich shop where you'll get sandwiches bigger than you can imagine. You'll want to take half of them home for lunch the next day. Also across the street from Main Street Deli is the um, Ber M Main Street Enchanted Tea Room, which is a great little tea, sh tea room where you can have high tea, uh, cucumber sandwiches and all that stuff you get when you're having teas. Um, we also have the Maryland Wine Bar which serves nothing but Maryland wine, wines and I think there's over 50 different uh, uh, brands that you can get in there. Um, and of course we've always got the Drummer's Cafe located in the Atlantic Hotel. Been there for a number of years. It's got a great reputation. Around the corner is the Globe which is a great sandwich bar, entertainment place to buy lunch and dinner and then across is the uh, Rains Reef Luncheonette great uh, sandwich shop and ice cream uh, place Gr uh, hamburgers and all kinds of uh, lunch food you can't beat it it's great open late some nights a lot of places are open late uh, you'll find almost any type of food you'll want here uh, we've got um, a new place Burley Inn is about to open up in a about a month and of course, Burley Oak Brewery out on Old Ocean City Boulevard is a great place. Great beer, craft beers they make there, and you can't go wrong. It's a great place. Come to Berlin. We're only seven miles west of Ocean City. You'll spend a day, day and a half. Um, you can stay at the Atlantic Hotel. Great um, little hotel, 16-room hotel. You can eat and, and shop your way all day long. Plenty. Plenty to do, plenty of variety of stores, everything from vintage toys to uh, educational toys, gifts, uh, all kinds of giftware, antique mall, two great large antique malls. Uh, you'll spend the day eating and shopping. Great place. It's the home of Runaway Bride, where Runaway Bride was filmed, Tuck Everlasting. So if you've seen those movies, you've got a little glimpse of small town life in Berlin, Maryland. <laughs>Hi, I'm Dan from DA Cosma Jewelers. People often ask me, how can you pay so much for the gold and silver that you buy? Well, it's because we recycle it to make other beautiful new jewelry. We buy gold and silver jewelry, sterling silverware, gold and silver coins, whether just a few or a larger collection. We will evaluate them and pay you immediately. Remember, at DA Cosma Jewelers and the Ocean City Factory Outlets, we want to recycle your gold and silver and we'll pay you more for it. Welcome to this edition of Talking Golf. I'm Buddy Sash, your host professional here at the Ocean City Golf Club. And today I'm here with Richard Holland of the Atkins Company. And Richard and I work together from time to time on, on his game. And early in the year, let's face it, putting's about half the game. We spend a little extra time on putting. Well, this year the big talk, of course, is the belly putters and the long putters and the advantages or disadvantages of those. But one thing us golf professionals have been teaching for years is how to control the top end of the putter so that you don't get that yippy kind of flippy stroke. So we have a very simple drill that I do here with Richard to help him smooth out his stroke, especially early in the year with the shorter putter. But he uses a lot of the attributes mm -hmm. of a long putter. So Richard, if you'll come over here and face the camera. Okay. We set the ball down. I've got a ruler in here between his elbows, and I don't want the ruler to change very much and for his top end of his stroke to be very, more like a pendulum, very smooth. So we'll let Richard putt a couple, nice and smooth, to get the hang of it. Very nice. 
And what I'm looking for and what Richard's looking for is very smooth at the top that the ruler doesn't change position greatly, mm -hmm. okay? It's very smooth, it's not flippy, it's very uh, calm and flowing. And even though it's early in the year, the green is a little bumpy, Richard is very, very smooth with his stroke. Very nice. Now Richard will do that for five or 10, 15 minutes, then go on about his business. How has this helped you, Richard? It really has helped our game early in the year to have uh, get a smooth pendulum flow. And uh, I work a lot with the pros here at Ocean City Golf Club, and it's good to get out early and uh, to get the game going fast in the spring. So find yourself a pro this spring and improve your game. You'll enjoy your golf much better. Thank you. Thanks again for watching this edition of Talking Golf here at the Ocean City Golf Club. Thank you for joining me, Richard. Thank you very much, buddy. Hi, welcome to Gold's Gym, located on 115th Street inside the Gold Coast Mall. I'm Beverly First, General Manager of the Gym. Come with me as we step inside and take a tour of the facilities and see all that Gold's Gym has to offer. gym with Gary. He makes exercising so much fun. I feel like the hour just slips right by and it's easy. Uh, it's a wonderful blend of, of functional training mixed with all the machines and it just gives me the best workout ever. I really look forward to coming here. At Gold's Gym we have something for everyone. You'll find cardio equipment, strength training equipment, along with great group exercise classes like Zumba, body pump, indoor cycling, yoga, and Pilates, just to name a few. Also available now, new tanning beds, a kids club, massage service, and a post-workout smoothie bar. At Gold's, we are committed to help you reach your goals and achieve your potential through fitness. Please stop in for a tour. How you doing? I'm Gary Howard. I'm Director of Personal Training and Special Events here at Gold's Gym in Ocean City. I love my position here. It's fun. I love working with my clients. I love helping them to achieve their goals and making their workouts fun. It's fun for me to train individuals like these. It's just like when I used to train Arnold Schwarzenegger in California for the Olympia back in 75. It's just a lot of fun. Keen and I'm the owner of Gold's Gym in Ocean City, Maryland. We've made so many great changes here over the past two years and would love to show you the gym and what you can do to be healthy and have fun. Sirle Chuhascaria is carving out a whole new experience in Delmarva Dining. After grilling a variety of meats on our special mesquite flamed grill, Sirle's honors over a three century tradition of Brazilian rodizio service. Treat yourself, family, and friends to an abundant seasonal salad area, including appetizers, gourmet vegetables, soups, and salads. Turn your place cards to green and be prepared to be served by a troupe of professional carving gauchos, generously serving 19 various cuts of seasoned certified Angus beef lamb, pork, chicken, and Brazilian sausage. All meats are accompanied by traditional side items like garlic mashed potatoes, rice, caramelized bananas, Brazilian beans, and our famous house-baked cheese bread. While dining endlessly on Brazilian fare, we will pair the perfect wine from our extensive wine list or sip on one of our signature drinks like Sirle's Caipirinha. 
be sure to save room for one of our decadent desserts. Sirle's Copacabana Bar offers your favorite libation while enjoying appetizers, soup, salads, and delicious sandwiches. Sirle's in the town center by the giant in Millville, Delaware, off of Route 26. It's the only family-owned and operated Brazilian steakhouse on Delmarva. Visit Sirle's soon. Bring your family and friends for an unforgettable international experience. A trip to Brazil, right here on Delmarva. Don't let the price of summer fun get you down. Go to KillerCouponBook.com and get incredible deals all over town. Restaurants, amusement parks, golf, water sports, and so much more. Go to KillerCouponBook.com, pick your coupons, print them, and go have fun. It's really that easy. KillerCouponBook.com Hi, thanks for watching another edition of Beach and Beyond. I hope you enjoyed today's show. I know I really enjoyed today's show here at Chesapeake Bay Farms. This ice cream is delicious, and it's taken me the whole episode to eat it. So stick around with us next week to uh, find out all of the great things to see and do at the Beach and Beyond.